Welcome back, everybody. We are celebrating Minnesota Makers today on the show. I'm loving this. This is great. Y'all are going to want all of this stuff at the end of the show. And don't worry, it'll live forever on YouTube. It's only been a few years since two local guys realized they needed they needed some Walt, a Walt, a Walt. They needed art on their walls of the apartment that they shared in Uptown. Well, one project got the notice of some friends. And now, as they say, the rest is history. They're now the owners of the company Uptown Woodworks. Joining me are the guys behind the company, Garrett and Harrison. Hey, guys. Thanks for having us here. Oh, no. This was, I got to tell you, I love stuff like this. And this, you're, you're going to see it in a second. You will see a little bit of it down there in the front of your screen. But this is beautiful. Did it really start by the fact that you all had no wall, you had no art on the walls? Yeah, we, uh, we became roommates in Uptown. And uh, we got in there and we surely realized we were staring at a bunch of blank walls <laughs> and um, right at about the same time I had joined a, a maker space. And uh, what is that? What is So for the people out there who don't know, a maker space yeah. is essentially like a gym, but instead of fitness equipment, they have equipment to make things. So 3D oh, printers, saws, uh, laser cutters. So we pay a monthly fee to use that space. Um, it's like a communal kitchen if you were exactly. like doing a pop-up restaurant. Like a okay. Yeah. So you were doing that and then so you thought, well, hell, I'm taking these classes. I'll make my own stuff. Yeah. So one of the first, you know, needs we had uh, was to make something for our walls. And we're going to look and we're showing you the graphic right now. This is the Minneapolis. Oh, there it is right there. So that skyline picture, correct me if I'm wrong. So did your friends, your friends would come over and notice it and was like, who made that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was uh, the first piece we made. Yeah, well, actually, Garrett brought it home, and, uh, you know, I was really blown away by it. You know, I was thinking, if you can make that, and we're just limited to a computer file, we can really make anything. So, uh, you know, we started to make some other things for the place as well, and just ideate on some ideas. And then, uh, finally, we really wanted to just try and prove the concept out, and, you know, find somewhere where we could go sell it. Did you, at that, so literally, the germ of the idea happened with that skyline picture. Yes. That yeah. was it. That was it. Is it still hanging up somewhere? Do you guys still have it? We, we actually, actually sold it. Yeah, sold Shut it. up! <laughs> <laughs> I hope you got, now, the more famous you get, I hope you all got some money for it. Okay, <laughs> so uh, let's, why, uh, Leo's taking a pretty uh, wide shot down here. I'm, I just want to get down here. Look at all of this stuff, guys. How long, like, talk, like this one right here, do you, do you guys come up with all the designs or like if someone comes to you and says, hey, you know, I want the state of Minnesota, but and here are my colors. Do you work with people, or are these all of your original ideas there? So, we do both. Yeah, you do both, okay. Uh, what I want to stress to people out there watching is we specialize in doing custom wooden wall art for folks, but at the same time, we also create our own designs, and we make the designs that we create available for purchase right from our website. Mm -hmm. um, There's but, that Minneapolis right there. Yeah. Uh, so if you saw one of the designs we make, yeah, uh, you can have that made larger or smaller. You could change the colors. You can personalize it with like your last name or something to that extent. That is how long? What, okay, what 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 are you doing right there? What was that? Is that like the the, the tracing of the of the element? Yeah. So that machine's called a CNC router. Uh, we put the design file into the the computer and then a computer controlled drill bit essentially cuts out the design it's, it's really crazy you're just look limited at, to oh file. no wait a minute that is fantastic look at this look at the death star okay now was that an original idea or did someone order that so someone just came to us with that design idea and so we mocked it up on the computer for them you know for approval and then once we had approval we moved forward with it and created it for their new uh, newborn's room Th that's that is for a newborn's room okay if i had a baby that would be okay. so and then down here this is just like the minnesota hockey that is that is absolutely beautiful, guys. Oh, now let's let's hold up some of these. I'm not going to touch a thing. <laughs> so you guys, can we start with this one? This is sure. gorgeous, guys. Yeah, yeah. So this is uh, we like to create things with some local flavor um, yeah. that appeal to uh, Minnesotans like ourselves. Oh, uh, so beautiful. This is one piece we we came up with. Hello, Duluth. We're uh, we our show is up in Duluth. Look at this. Y'all want this, I know. All of you in Duluth are going to want this hanging. This is beautiful. We've just, actually done this in uh, Colors of UMD and a few other schools up there, too. Uh, people just had the idea and came to us and wanted it for themselves. Well, let me ask you, this is a good, like, someone's, because I, I, they can see kind of the, this compared to the size of my head. 
if they want this in a smaller size, can they do that too? Yeah. Because I'm, I, I always try to think of what people are asking. So, okay, okay. let's. We have about a minute left. I want to get to the other ones real quick. Again, I ain't touching nothing. Okay. Oh, that's beautiful. Look at this, guys. That's gorgeous. So, is this an original, or was this something that was ordered? By us, uh, we made different world maps. This just happens to be one of them that Garrett made uh, for his own place. Oh, so thank you for taking it off your wall. I appreciate it. Yeah. I, and, then, and then, is that the Minneapolis skyline or a version yep. of it? Yep. Okay, let's see that. That's not, it's not the original, because like we said, that thing was sold. Yeah, this oh. is just a different color scheme of the original Minneapolis skyline. I love this. This is, did you guys, I, I have, I'm big on logos. Was, I bet it was a cool feeling in the, to see your logo hanging up in a store, in a pop-up. I bet that was a, a nice moment for you guys. It's definitely, definitely a cool feeling, you know, um, just seeing that people really resonate with it and yeah. you know, like what we do. Um, it's also great to know that if we uh, create a design uh, and hopefully other people like it, you know, yeah. uh, that's another good thing. It's fantastic. Garrett and Harrison from Uptown Woodworks. For more information, bloop, they're right in the bottom of your screen, head to uptownwoodworks.com. And like I said, we're going to post all of these segments on our Facebook page a little bit later.